Adam, another important win today back at home, uh, 4-1 against Leaston. Give us your thoughts after that. Yeah, on paper, a very tricky test. They've had some really, really good results. You know, they've won at Peterborough, um, at Banbury. Banbury scored, I think it was 94th minute. Sat in fifth place. So, yeah, it was always going to be tricky today. I said to lads about application was key. Um, and I think we've done that. Um, I thought a chance creation was, again, unbelievable. Um, and, and at 4-0, I managed, it, it was a good table for me to manage the game, make, make a few changes and just slow ourselves down a little bit. Um, so, so yeah, great day's work. Um, outstanding. Um, outstanding goals were scored, weren't they? And uh, again, the chances that we created as well, some of the football was was different class. But um, yeah, really, really good. And to get some lads some minutes on the pitch, again, Con's come in today. Um, excellent throughout. It was good to be able to take him off and give him a breather as well. So, um, good day's work for us all. Yeah, you made two changes. Elliot Putman came back at left back because Kean was suspended and you brought Connor in for Steve Towers. Just to explain the reason behind that. Yeah, um, again, Connor's been chomping at the bit and, you know, he's away on holiday for a week and the form's been excellent. So, t today was the time to, to chuck him in on the back of two. Um, Tough, heavy away games on heavy pitches, and then obviously with Keane suspended, Putty just comes in and, and does well and does what he does well. So um, you know, as I spoke about all season, it's about as um, whoever whoever comes in doing the, the job for the team, and that's why we've got a close a close bunch there um, who will never ever let me down. So yeah, really pleased with the lads today. Um, but again, big game comes on Tuesday now as well. Yeah, so we're going really at some pace at the minute with Peterborough and Banbury, the top three for quite some time now. I know there's other teams with games in hand, but obviously one of them teams comes here on Tuesday. Banbury won again today against Lowestoft, not lost in the league. So it's going to be a you know a massive game under the lights down here, isn't it? Well, yeah, exactly. I mean, uh, the table, you know, the table saying that obviously that they've not lost a game. So, so we've got we've got the best team in in the league coming here. Um, so you know we've got to be ready because you know the. Got some good players, um, got good support, um, and you know we'll come here full of confidence. Um, so it should be a cracking game, and you know I think again, what more do you want Tuesday night football? Two two good teams, two good teams which played which played decent football as well. A lot of exciting players, so yeah, so looking forward to it. Crowd were good again today, weren't they? And I think for the Peterborough game we got five eight eight from memory. Uh, be good to get. Even more than that Tuesday. Oh well, yeah, you, you know you certainly like to think so. Um, again, it's all it's all. I think we've played seventeen games now, so we're getting halfway <laughs> through the season already, aren't we? Um, but yeah, I mean the crowds, you know, see see the difference with them all down here now, and um, I think Tuesday they'll all be. Uh, I think they'll all be keen as mustard in the in the local area because I think Banbury will bring a few as well. So yeah, so who knows what sort of crowd we'll get on Tuesday? But I'm sure it'll be a big one.